In this video tutorial, I'm gonna talk about how to create Java form to execute ADB command. So, first of all, I'm gonna create new project. We select new project, then Java, then Java application, then next ADB form. This is the name of the project then finish now the project have been created successfully we don't need this file so I'm gonna remove it okay then yes now I'm gonna I'm going to create a new Java JFrame we're gonna select the, the package name then right click the new JFrame form and let's rename it ADB then finish now let's pull a button from this place yeah this is a button okay let's rename it as reboot any Android device okay this is the name of the button here uh, the awesome thing we don't have to write the button click event because NetBeans generate the code by default you, ha you have just to double click the button to get the button click event area now write anything you want here to be executed after the, bot after the user press a button or click the button Let's write a try catch a block to avoid any exception that may have been at runtime. So try then catch okay everything now is okay mm, I think I have a syntax error here exception now everything is okay to minimize the video time I'm gonna just copy paste the code okay this is the code which will execute adb comment any adb, ADB comment you have to paste it here in the try block you have just to edit here you will make it adb.exe here you're gonna write any adb command you want here okay in the third argument the last step we have to copy adb package to the project path let's go this is the adb package let's copy then what is the name of our project it's adb4 now copy the zip file paste the zip file in the root directory of the project and then extract in the root directory of the project extract here don't uh, choose ex extract files okay extract here now everything should work let's run the project okay Okay. okay here we have powered on Android device let's click reboot any Android device okay as you say it's working let's see what will happen after we press the button it hangs we should not rename this file as adb2exe you have to keep it cmd okay now let's try again okay now let's press the button yeah okay now 
the device is rebooted successfully okay I'm gonna put the source code in the in this video description لا تنسوا الإعجاب بالفيديو والاشتراك في القناة تشجيعا لنا لنستمر بنشر المزيد إن شاء الله